everyone. In this video, we will show you how to insert edges in Nebula Graph. Firstly, please make sure that you have created the follow and serve edge types as we showed you in the previous video. Now, we will insert some edges into Nebula Graph using the insert edge statement. Enter the insert edge statement first, then the edge type name, follow, then the property name, the keyword values, the source VID, the direction arrow, the destination VID, and finally, a colon followed by the property value. Here, the source VID is 100 and the destination VID is 101. Use the fetch prop on statement to fetch the edge you just inserted. Note that the edge property is returned, which indicates the edge is inserted successfully. Now, we are going to introduce how to insert multiple edges for the follow edge type simultaneously. Note that you need to enter the source VID and the destination VID for each edge and the direction arrow between them, and then the property values separated by commas. Similarly, we are going to insert two more edges for the serve edge type simultaneously. OK, all edges have been inserted. We can fetch the properties of these edges with the fetch prop on statement. The property values for these edges are returned, which indicates these edges have been inserted successfully. If you want to insert multiple edges of the same edge type between two vertices, you can use the ranking parameter. For example, you can insert another edge whose type is follow between VID 100 and VID 101 with the ranking parameter. Note that we have to enter the ranking value after the add symbol. Here, we enter 1 as the ranking value. You can check the edge with the ranking parameter using the fetch prop on statement in which you need to specify the add symbol. You can see the property value is returned, which indicates the edge with the ranking value is inserted successfully. If you want to delete an edge, you can use the delete edge statement, and you need to specify the edge type and the source VID and destination VID for this to be deleted edge. Use the fetch prop on statement again to check whether the edge has been deleted. No property value for this edge is returned, which indicates the edge has been deleted. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please leave us a like and subscribe to our YouTube channel so that you'll be the first to know our content updates. If you have any constructive criticism or problems, please leave a comment below. Your feedback is always appreciated. Finally, if you enjoy Nebula Graph, head over to our GitHub repo to help us grow.